The Democratic Alliance in Houghton has called for formal investigation into the construction of 82 million Maibuye Primary School in Itembisa e Kululeni. The state-of-the-art school, opened in February this year by Houghton Premier Panyaza Lesofi and Education MEC Matome Chilaone, began construction in 2017. One reason for the seven-year delay in the school's operation is that it was built in the wetland, making it waterlogged and prone to flooding. Additionally, it is situated along a sewer line leading to sewage spillage issue during floodings. The DA has accused the ANC-led Houghton government of reversing its decision to hold an inquiry into the shoddy workmanship at the school. Alan Fash, a DA member of the Houghton legislature, stated that this reversal indicated the government disregard for protecting the interests of Houghton residents. A recent report by the public protector revealed the various form of maladministration and new delays and irregularities in the school's construction. The report highlighted the poor project management, planning, and the collaboration between the education and infrastructure departments, resulting in the school's location on a sewer line and a wetland area. The report also noted that access to construction area was granted 13 months after the contractor was appointed, leading to additional costs exceeding 10 million rands. The public protector has instructed the Houghton Department of Infrastructure Development to submit a project plan within 60 days, detailing how and when the remaining external civil work will be completed. The report has also been referred to the Auditor General of South Africa. Media has reached out to the Sufi's office for comments, but there was no response at the time of publishing. This story will be updated as more information becomes available.